Well, they're popping up everywhere in the woods, your front lawn, mushrooms of all shapes and sizes. Some are edible, some are not. And with a banner year for shrooms, thanks to all the rain we had, some people are wondering if they should dig in or dig them out. An expert tells me your best bet might be neither. Some of them hide beneath blades of grass in your lawn. Others pop out with looks that range from curious to cute to weird. Yes, foraging for and eating wild mushrooms is growing in popularity, but this is not an amateur sport. Mushroom poisoning is a real thing. David Hibbett is a biology professor at Clark University and agreed to look over some of our viewer submitted photos of mushrooms in their yards. There are absolutely some very dangerous poisonous mushrooms out there. Some of the ones in the photos you posted are um, toxic. There are wild mushrooms you can eat, like this one, commonly called hen of the woods. This is a fungus that um, is abundant right now, and it always grows at the base of a living oak, as these are. Um, this is edible. This is edible in choice when it's, when it's young. But others, like this one in the Ammonita group, are dangerous and have no place on your plate. So you need to be very, very careful. Even experts can struggle to identify some mushrooms. David says you should never eat one unless you're certain it's safe. If you know you have a dangerous mushroom and you have a small child or pet, you may want to pluck the shroom, but it won't be a permanent fix. You won't get rid of the fungus that way because most of the most of the organism is underground. Uh, the mycelium is this um, network of thread-like filaments that is in the ground or in a log or wherever. If there's no risk, David says, no worries. Mushrooms are beneficial to the environment, often providing support to nearby trees. Most mushrooms are not tremendously dangerous. So I would not encourage people to just routinely go out and try to clear their yards of, of fungi. They should be happy they're there. They're beautiful and interesting. If you've got mushrooms growing you'd like to know more about or want a better idea of what is and isn't safe, David says there are mycology groups all around the country ready to help. Mycology, the study of mushrooms. You can find info at WNYT.com. Just click on links. So is shroom just another name for mushroom? Sure, mushroom, shroom, funny looking thing. All right, th thank you. <laughs>